Good morning, Falcons. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Thank you. You may be seated. Good morning, Falcons. I'm Lane Oak. And I'm Austin Leedy. And here's your morning announcements for Thursday, February 9th, 2017. The Franklin High Special Olympics basketball team defeated Marysville last night with a score of 34-22. The team is now 6-0. Points were scored by Ashley Adams, Khalil Cohen, William De La Rosa, Jerry De Delegato, Jamal Foster, Isaiah Johnson, Beth Mitchell, and Justin Terry. It's the team would like to thank everyone who came to support them. The team's last home game will be next Wednesday, February 15th at 6.30. Admission is free. The seniors will be honored, so your support and a great turnout will be greatly appreciated. Go Falcons! Columbus Parent Magazine and this week's news are looking for a new great teachers to honor this year with the 2017 Teachers of the Year Awards. School representatives, parents, and students can be nominated can nominate teachers by visiting columbusparent.com slash teachers or thisweeksnews.com slash teachers. To fill out the nomination form, nominations must be submitted by March 15th. Consider nominating one of your worthy teachers today. After a successful meeting of the Creative Writing Club last week, further meetings have been planned for Tuesday mornings from 7.20 to 7.50 and Thursday afternoons from 3.30 to 4.30 in room 3215. It isn't too late to join. See Ms. Patterson with any questions. For any guys interested in playing boys tennis, there will be a quick informational meeting today, February 9th, right after school in room 2215 with Mr. K. If you are riding a bus, Mr. K will have information ready so you can stop by and still make your bus in time. You can also stop by room 2215 during periods 1 through 4, 6th, and 8th during the week. Do you have a sweetheart, a best friend, a favorite teacher, or a special someone? With Valentine's Day coming up, next Tuesday, Key Club has a deal for you. They have handcrafted flowers for Valentine's Day delivery. You can also add special handwritten notes to attach with it. The cost is only $1.50 per flower. Orders can be placed in a cafeteria during your lunch the whole week of February 6th to 10th, and they will be delivered to your special someone on Valentine's Day during second period. What a way to say you care. Looking for a nice date, good food, and live music? Come to the National Honor Society annual spaghetti dinner on Friday, February 24th from 5.30 to 8.30. Dinner includes spaghetti, salad, breadsticks, dessert, and a drink, all for only $7. There will be live music provided by FHHS Orchestra and Band. See Ms. Mann or Ms. Sheldon for tickets. Do you enjoy working on computers and learning about computer programming? Do you have an interest in creating apps? If you'd answered yes, see Ms. Ahmed or Ms. Miller to join the CBUS Student Hack coding team for a seven-week program contest. Organized by Franklin University and AT&T, you can see Ms. Ahmed in room 3212 or Ms. Miller in 2216 if you're interested. Believe it or not, it's time for, to start thinking about your class schedule for the next year. Something to consider is the opportunity to earn college credits while still in high school. The best part is it's free. Check out the video about the College Credit Plus program to learn more. I think it's an opportunity of a lifetime. I get to knock out college credit, which I would have to pay for after I get out of high school. Now I'm already ahead of the game and I can already get a sense of what college is gonna be like. I think it's really cool because a lot of people don't get that opportunity and to be able to get a head start is so different. When I'm in the classroom, I feel like everyone is more engaged. It just really gives me a head start because I have several ideas of what I want to do in the future and I know that what I'm doing now is gonna help me so much.
I know it's gonna be challenging, but I feel like now that I got this experience, I can do it. For me to be a sophomore and taking college classes and being like good at it is like, it's just amazing. An opportunity to move forward. There are a lot more places you can go after college than you could go after high school. I'm really honored to have this opportunity to take college while still in high school. I can work hard, I can do all of these things, and still be successful at it. Now here's Chase and Mariana with today's weather, sports, and birthdays. Good morning, I'm Chase. And I'm Mariana Ramirez here with today's weather, sports, and birthdays. Today's high temperature will be 25 degrees with a slight chance of snow flurries this morning. The low overnight will be 17. Tomorrow will be 39 degrees with partly cloudy skies. The low will be 25. Expect warm temperatures and rain this weekend with highs in the 50s. Good luck to the wrestling team as they travel to Big Walnut tonight. There are no birthdays today. Now, now back, back to, to you guys. guys. Thanks, guys. Today's lunch will be pizza of the day, a bacon cheeseburger, or chicken and waffles. In order to check out any information we shared today, be sure to visit our website, wfhsnews.weebly.com. Have, Have a, a great, great day, day, Falcons. Falcons.